Hey y'all, Juliana here. I'm standing in front of a towering native plant. It's the oak leaf hydrangea or hydrangea quercifolia. Named for its large oak-like leaves, the oak leaf hydrangea is an excellent plant for our native plant gardens. It is a real showstopper, producing massive leaves that change color in the fall and huge, beautiful panicles of creamy white flowers that pollinators adore. But wait a minute, are those really flowers? Upon closer inspection, it becomes clear that those creamy white flowers are actually sepals, which means that they are not flowers at all. Instead, they are modified to be large and showy and appear like flowers in order to lure attraction to their true flowers. In order to see the real flowers of a hydrangea, we must tear our gaze from those showy sepals and look a little deeper. Massed and clustered below the false flowers, you will find dozens and dozens of small, fragrant flowers that are true flowers producing pollen, nectar, and when pollinated, seeds. Our native hydrangeas take this form because large showy sepals are much less energy expensive than large showy flowers. and large showy sepals still attract the attention of potential pollinators and bring their gaze towards the inconspicuous flowers concealed beneath. Even our non-native broadleaf hydrangea employs this tactic and produces giant mop heads of pink, purple, and blue false flowers. But because of the way it's been cultivated, our broadleaf hydrangea produces very few, if any, true flowers, meaning that its beauty only goes sepal deep and it is worthless for pollinators. So if you haven't already, I encourage you to make the switch. Choose oak leaf hydrangea over the broadleaf hydrangea and create a garden that is both beautiful and valuable for wildlife.